friends today I want to make um, some artist trading coins and to make these coins I'm going to use some of my scraps I have tons of little scrap papers so I'm going to be using up my scraps and snips and stuff like that I'm going to be using a computer paper um, printed paper kind of thing as well as drawing on here to make a little duck because my today's theme I'm going to start a off duck with so if you is this I measured out to two and a half inches and um, artist trading coins up, I, I found to be that they're supposed to be two and a half inches about and um, so that's how round this is this lid spray spray lid so I'm going to do a few circles um, with this and then I'm going to know whoops that's not a very good circle that's just for my guide to know where to draw my duck and how big I'm going to use watercolor pencils of different assortments to color in these guys. And I'm going to use my water brush to um, kind of paint the watercolor pencils in. So that's what I'm going to do. And then I'm going to cut these guys out.
trying to play with my thing. It's not working. So these are the ones. Anyway, I'm going to go all the way out. So here is this duck carrying a bag of gifts. Just a fun little cartoon ducks. If you guys have any other ducks or stickers or anything you want to use, I just want to go with a duck theme, and you can use any kind of theme that you want to go with it. And here is my duck with a candy cane. And here is my little duck with a little evergreen tree. And now I'm going to probably just outline these guys really quickly, see if I can, how I like that. I'm going to test out this pen. That one won't work. It'll be too thick. But I'm going to, I want to cut these guys out. I might just ink my edges up and I'm going to make some backgrounds um, on here. So I'm going to probably start the backgrounds on here and um, go from there. So I'm going to speed through this process. I'm going to use some of my scrap papers I have here and all that kind of good stuff. Now my three inch, or I mean, sorry, two and a half inch circles have some a background. I use the, I had to use separate cards because these ones were bent and I didn't want my card bent. But I use the orange that is in the background on these as part of my, um, just that look I wanted behind the, the tissue paper. And I just decided to grab the tissue paper last minute and work with that. All these different little things I have around here. I got lots of little scraps and some scrap papers and I want to tear them. I want to have a certain tear where it wasn't the white showing so I t tore it towards the color that I where I wanted it, glued it. Now I am ready I think for my guys. I may add a little gesso um, circles or something like that with this but before I do, I'm going to decide, before I decide to do that, I'm going to cut these guys out and see where I want to place them and see if I want to add a little bit of a white. Um, cards. I, I'm going to turn them into gift tags. Whoops! I dried these up already, and that's what I'm going to do with these particular ones. And I think the kids are going to love them. And I made my little ducky a gift tags for them. So that's what these ones are going to be. And I might seal them, but that is how they're turning out. Cute little card have room for a little hole on top and the ribbon so definitely I'm making these into little gift tags and if you guys are going to join me along I'm going to try to do a one a week and I'm going to give you a theme at the beginning of the video and you guys can follow along and chat with me um, in my comments and I'll get back to you guys 
as well as if you have any ideas for themes, you can share them in the comments. And there we go. There. And that is my little piece. I think it's so cute. Maybe I might write some words with stickers. And uh, let's see if I can write the word joy and those kind of things. I think that would be really cute. And in the back, I will stamp to and from and the names for those gifts. And I think that that little piece is going to be done. There's my cat being a sticker. Okay. Reese Packer. Okay. My evergreen has some nice little decorations all highlighted here. And then just a little glisten on the eyes. Just a little. Do you another why? Now these were sent to me in Happy Meal. These little stickers. And they are pretty handy. I don't use them all the time. They're Tim Holtz ideology. They're really cute. Though. I'm going to put joy in all their little tummies just because I think that's cute. And then we'll be done. Really cute. Well, I'm going to try to get once a week out of these um, these cards. I'm going to start getting into them. I'm started looking at them, and I'm thinking, I can, I can want to play with these for a little bit. So we'll see how this journey goes and how long it goes for. But I'm going to try to continue working with these once a week, and hopefully you guys can follow along, and I'm going to try to do a nice theme with these. And here is my finished cards. Aren't they cute, these little ducks? I'm going to move my cord. And this is it. So these are going to turn into little tags, gift tags, these arts trading cards. And they are two and a half inches around in diameter. And that is um, how they turn out. And let's see if we can get the uh, camera to focus. That's how they turned out. Ah, I might have forgot to do the little guy's beak on here in, in pen. There we go. And that is them. Um, and I got little joy on their belly, so it's so cute. For my little ducks, to your little ducks. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and don't forget to craft like a duck. Bye, guys.